I ground myself to be sure that I'm grounded. Um, so I always put a root into the ground and I use the flint to help me do that. And then I start to read for someone because you know I've done comic readings, astrological readings for the last 45 years and I've learned very quickly that if I don't root and ground myself first I'm nowhere near as focused for doing the reading. And so I, it, when we did the workshop and when we do the next one, the first thing I teach is grounding yourself and then you start to read. Because otherwise you, you drift. It's the only way I can describe it for me. It's like I'm drifting and then I think, oh, I'm supposed to be doing a reading. Or, you know, I'm, I'm just not really with it. It's, it's, it's like I'm off. It's energetically I'm off kilter if I'm not grounded firmly. Go from the bottom of my feet, I grow roots that go right down to the centre of the earth. And it's like, whoosh, you know, I've done it so often now. But that, if you just think that you're, you've got roots and you're going right down, that's the way to do it. And it was funny because I had a gong bath the night before last and I was sort of lying on a, a reclining bed because I didn't want to be on the floor because it was under floor heating. And I could feel my feet actually go I thought, what on earth's going on? And I realised that my roots were being released so that I could take the energy of the gong into me instead of also grounding it into the earth. And that really reminded me, oh yeah, you know, I walk around with these roots all the time. Anything else? Sorry, anything round the corner that where I can't see you. <laughs> the first one is what I would call an ordinary amethyst, the the sort that you know you find in geodes and, and um, blocks of amethyst. It's just um, an amethyst point, and this. It's not low vibration, but it's the densest of the vibrations. And then the Auralite 23, which is only found in one place in the Cave of Wonders, great place to find, uh, in Canada. It's actually, the reason it's called 23 is it's actually got a great many other minerals in it, as well as amethyst. And that takes you up to the higher sort of mental plane it's a completely different feeling and then the Brandenburg again it's a it's a very high vibration so the, yes they're all amethysts but it's the vibration of them that's different